Hi my darlings, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello, my name's Chrissy. I'm so pleased you could stop by. I would love it if you would subscribe before you leave. To my OGs, don't forget to turn your notification bell on so YouTube can tell you every time I upload a video. Today is the second part in my Black Friday haul. So if you'd like to see what I've bought, please continue to watch. So my darling, this is uh, the box from Beauty Bay and all sorts. It's like deja vu. This is like my revolution size of the box, but this is the other stuff. Right, so I think firstly I'm actually going to show you my um my jewellery stash from Twee. Um I've brought quite a few items, uh, quite a few sets from her launch. Obviously she was so kind in sending me um, all of that PR a few weeks ago uh, in the charity bags. So I just wanted to repay her a little bit and support her new venture. Bling hoops, these are the two pack. These are 15 pounds. Now you get a really nice big pair there, but you also get a really nice wearable little pair as well. They're for pair stairs, but they've got this little clasp, which is a little bit of extra security and it makes you, it makes the sort of, the way it sits really nicely. So those are my first pack. I wear these a lot. You've probably seen me wearing these a lot in my videos. I tend to wear them. Well, I tend to wear these more than anything just at the moment because they are new as well. These are the layering pack. So you've got three different sorts of earrings here. I'm going to take these off because you can't see them very well on the card. So you've got a little tiny pack of hoops there. They're all for pierced ears. And then you've got this one here. So this one sort of sits here. So it actually looks like it's going through your ear. So it looks like it's going all the way uh, through. And you've got two of those. And then you've got two of these pretty little cuffs. Have them, you can have them close. You can have them hanging. But they are a nice little accessory. But you get two of those. You get Well, you get two of each. I think it's a bit much to have all of them on at the same time. Uh, these pack of three are £16. That is the dearest thing in the collection for twice. The Starburst Chain Drop Earrings. Uh, these are stunning. So we've got these beautiful Starbursts here. You've also got another pack of studs here. But these here detach and you can wear them as like um, an ear jacket. So you can wear these on their own. That is the actual dangly bit. So you can wear that with a stud or you can wear it with this, like this. Sometimes I wear it at the front, sometimes I wear this part at the back. So it just depends what I fancy at the time. But really, really sparkly. A set of earrings these were 14 pound you can coordinate them all with each other i think that's what she's done with a whole set so if you want something totally different you can sort of make your own look up those are the earrings i bought and then i actually brought uh, two lots of necklaces and it is called the gold charm necklace So you've got like all of these droppers. It's a double layer. It is one necklace and it looks like you've got all these droppers and the way they've got like a, a cut to them look really sparkly. There's no no sort of jewel, uh, gems in them. It just looks like really sparkly. As you can see. Like I said, I've wore this a lot as well. It's a bling layer necklace, these two pack. This is by, by far the prettiest thing I've ever seen. This stoned dropper here. That's like a choker. And then you add it to this one here. And it is just 
so pretty so delicate if you do watch Twee you've seen her wearing this she wears this one all the time and it is a really really pretty set that one was £16 the other one was £14 you obviously get the set extra extra necklace with this but together they look beautiful they're a little bit more expensive than your normal costume jewellery but they are so sparkly I couldn't wait to get on with them no secret to everybody what the Stacey Marie Carnival 3 Love Tahiti palette looks like. I did not to go along with the hype uh, on launch day and I managed to get it for £26. So we've all seen this before, you don't need any introduction to it but I hadn't actually seen it and it is so so better in real life than on the pictures. You just can't see the beauty of it when uh, when you're online so that is absolutely stunning all of this this is my side without a doubt so you've got like sort of pinks purples oranges greens and a couple of blues so it does work with the excel palette really well too so i might just sort of swatch those all together one day I think I was like really late to the party with this but I knew I was going to buy it, it was just a matter of when. So that is the beautiful Carnival 3 palette and there is word that there's four on the way too which is always exciting. These I have been umming, ahhing, definitely wanting to get them but every time my um, payday come I forgot them so I managed to get the two Lewis Cosmetics um, palettes and they are so beautiful Teresa Ella, Elena this is your fault but primarily Teresa but they are I am absolutely amazed at these beautiful packaging beautiful little card when it came like sort of personalized really really nice little touches that you don't sort of get uh, in the bigger brands uh, absolutely will be buying some more things from there so this one is the gone rogue palette i'm not going to swatch them today i'm just going to show you what i've bought you have probably already seen this as well if you follow make me up miss if you're one of her sausages you have seen the looks that she's made with this and it's beautiful so that one is the gone rogue palette then this is the one i wanted i absolutely loved the look of this online but in real life it is so so much nicer they have created such a such a beautiful girly palette so this is the rose metal palette and i'm more than likely have colors like this anyway but as a palette how beautiful is that it is absolutely stunning so I cannot wait to have a play with that. I only bought the two palettes for now. I will be buying other things very soon. Maybe in the new year. So that's those. Then we have got Beauty Bay. The first thing I brought, these are older palettes and there's a couple of new ones, but these are mainly older palettes. Uh, so I bought I managed to get the Beauty Bay Pastel Palette. It's only a tiny little palette, but it wasn't very expensive. And there we have it. It is for summer. It will be for summer, but it was just one of those that everybody's always recommending. So we have it at last. Staying with Beauty Bay and one of the older palettes. I was going to buy this the first time it came out and, and I didn't and so I'm glad I waited because they've updated the uh, the packaging this is the bright mats look at that for a shocking pink colour how, how summer is that it is classic rainbow palettes but they are meant to be such good quality so that's another one to add to the collection can you hear my tummy rumbling i am sorry these would make a makeup lover's christmas present a really good one this one caught my eye 
quite a few people have used this and it is such a lovely palette and um, this one was down to less than £10 so this was coming home with me and it is the Beauty Bay Book of Magic. Look at that packaging. Wow, I just love that illustration on there. And the inside is better than the outside. You've got um I've got a mirror, you've got 20 shades. There we go. Look at that. Can you see those foils? How gorgeous they are, but they've got the mats that correspond with them so you've got everything that matches everything it is such a perfect palette i can't wait to try that so those are all the beauty bay's own brand palettes i've been looking at this for ages again like i say on beauty bay i sort of go through everything pick what i want stick it in my basket and there it stays until they have a sale or i've got some money whether it's payday or whether my cleaner has finished and for every three months i always have a beauty bay order so i've got some nicer products or some more expensive products so this one is sample beauty and it is the jeweled dual toned palette so lovely packaging and it is repeated on the actual palette itself you've got a mirror and you've got uh, 21 shades is it three six seven yeah 21 shades of pure bliss so i've been looking at this again i might keep on repeating myself but it's just one of those things i've seen it i've seen it for so long um and it was just there so i thought yeah why not this one you probably yeah you're gonna probably cost me and uh, well whatever i bought the the blood money palette now i've got everything else so i like greens and so i bought it you know it's I know people are gonna say yeah you're supporting somebody that's not very nice i understand that this is purely for the quality of shadows i won't be using it online so this is for my personal collection um so yeah so i am going to quickly show it you whether you want to turn off i understand if you don't want to see that that is absolutely fine but this is the palette so it is just one of those things that i'm going to buy i ain't going to be shouting about it but i've got it so that is the blood money palette so i do apologize if it offends you but we collectors we collect so i can put that back in there the last thing i bought from beauty bay was i've been waiting for this and i think i bought it and it's too dark so i'm gutted but i'll i will just buy a lighter color um, it is a brow liner but it's a felt tip but it actually looked sort of finer than this that is to make that is what the tips like but i could have swore blind it was finer than that but it's literally just a felt tip for your eyebrows but that is that's dark brown but that is literally black to me so i waited and waited that long and i've bought the wrong shade but if i have the brown it's too red so it's just a bit of sort of trial and I error think that was about nine pound which is quite expensive but because i'd got the discounts on the other things i was paying Klarna. i'd also got a code as well you know me i like a good code so i bought it but like i say i think that is going to be far far too dark um but i thought i'd give it a go to see if it's if it's any good so that is feeling bond by ardell and it is a, a bro marker let me know what you want to see from my channel in the new year i am open to suggestions obviously i've got my own ideas and i will run with those i've got my um my regulars that's i do on my channel but if there's anything specific that you'd like to see or that you'd like me to start please let me know down in the comment section i'm i'm all ears i'm open to any suggestions i think i've got some more products but you know 
they're probably downstairs um so i will just put them on another time darlings if you have enjoyed my little haul today don't forget to leave us a thumbs up that would be amazing and if you haven't already and you do like the look of my channel please consider subscribing i will be back on thursday with another throwback we're getting on nearly ready for christmas now so please come and join me on that one take care of yourselves guys and please stay safe i love you loads bye